The Pro Act Know How. Hi, this is uh, Pro Act Sam. Welcome to this episode of Living and Working Abroad. We, in the middle of December, got a last minute settlement uh, deal with Brexit, potentially going to be reached, but it's not been done yet. So I just thought I'd give a quick overview about on whether and what the critical issues are at stake. International treaties in business are resolved um, by the World Trade Organization. There's been a long running dispute between the EU and the um, USA uh, with state subsidies, in inverted commas, by the EU for Airbus, as well as a counter claim against Boeing by, by the EU. And this was ruled on last year quite heavily in favour of, of the USA against the EU. The EU is a protectionist zone for its member states, and that's okay, that, that's the way it is. But this is where the critical issue is down. There's three issues being given in the middle of December about why a deal can't be done. 90% of the trade deal is done in detail. And the three critical issues are state subsidies to, um, uh, to industry, who resolves the, the trade deal treaty, and fishing rights into UK waters. The um, EU resolves all its internal industrial disputes through the European Court of Justice, and the UK want none of that. They want to resolve their international trade disputes through, through the WTO, just like America, China, India, uh, Australia, and all the other large economies in the world do. And, and this is the sticking point, this is the critical issue. So if we've got um, the state subsidies that uh, if the UK leaves without a deal, then they will be resolved with the UK between the WTO um, and the EU. So uh, if there is no deal, if there is a deal, the EU is saying that they would like the ECJ to make that settlement. And that's what the UK are holding back on. That is their key point. They want no control of the EU or the EU legal system over the UK sovereign powers of government. And if that can be agreed upon between the EU and the UK, then it would be very easy for the UK to make a deal on fisheries. Fisheries is their bargaining chip to get what they want. If there's no deal, World Trade Organization rules would apply to trade disputes anyway. So what does the EU do to make a decision that's agreeable and compatible? Any negotiation has got to be acceptable to both parties. And that is what we're looking for before the end of December. We will see. Any expat family, business uh, or property owners living and working abroad, if you want any help or guidance on how the, the last minute trade deal will affect you and contact us. We already know about EU citizens' rights and uh, how we can affect and uh, implement those. Last minute changes going on, but if you've got any questions or queries, contact us at projectpartnership.com and follow our blogs and news items on Living and Working Abroad on our YouTube channel to keep in touch with the, the final stages and how any uh, permanent, temporary, or no deal is applied between the EU and the UK on trade. Thanks very much for listening and we'll see you again next time. The Proact Know How, brought to you by Proact.